Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Installing Matplotlib in Jupyter Notebook on Anaconda is super simple and in most cases it is already pre-installed. But if it is not, in today's video I'll uh, teach you how to install Matplotlib in Jupyter Notebook and Anaconda using three methods. So let's get started. So the first option is using Anaconda Navigator and this method requires no coding. So first we need to open Anaconda Navigator and then we need to go to environments tab on the left over here and then uh, first we need to check if matplotlib is installed or not so I'm in the install drop down and I'll search matplotlib so it's showing that it is already installed but still I can install other uh, packages related to matplotlib by going on the not installed section and then I'll search for matplotlib so these are some other packages that I can install that will uh, support matplotlib. So let me install these also. So I'll click on apply. Then I need to click on apply and this is showing that 5 packages will be modified and 13 packages will be installed. So now the, uh, the following packages are getting installed. So the next method involves using anaconda prompt and this is recommended also. So we need to open anaconda prompt and then we need to type the following command. Conda install matplotlib and then we need to click enter. So this will install matplotlib in your base environment. So it is showing that all requested packages already installed. This means that matplotlib is installed in Anaconda. So the third method is installing matplotlib inside Jupyter Notebook. So I can write conda install matplotlib y. So it is showing that all requested packages are already installed and if conda does not work inside uh, the Jupyter Notebook then we can also in write exclamation pip install matplotlib and we can after installation we can run this simple code to check if it is installed properly I can write import matplotlib.pyplot as plt then I can make two lists uh, for x I'll write 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and for y I'll write 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. Then what I'll do is I'll plot x and y plt dot plt dot plot x comma y then let me put the title as let me just write as plot and for the x label I'll write x axis and for the y label I'll write y axis and then to display the plot I'll write the command plt.show so we can see that matplotlib is working properly as this plot between the x and the y points have been generated properly. 
if you found this video helpful don't forget to like this video share it with your friends subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss an update see you in the next one